it's Friday, Friday, Friday. Uh, and I'm out of the house. First time out of the house since Tuesday. <laughs> My stomach's feeling normal. Of course, all of in today is watermelon. But we're gonna go get a bite to eat. But we're gonna, I'm gonna get something to bring home. I don't trust myself. I don't trust my belly and gut enough to eat out somewhere yet. Uh, so, yeah, I don't know what we're gonna get. I don't know where we're gonna go. I do know I gotta mail something, stop at the bank, and we're just gonna cruise. It's like one o'clock in the afternoon. Dad just cut this giant watermelon. So good. We have lots of watermelon in the fridge. We have a cantaloupe we cut up yesterday. He boiled a dozen eggs this morning. Um, so yeah. But ooh, other than that, just uh, waiting for Dad to come out of the house. Yeah. Okay, bye. It's hours later. <laughs> it's evening now. It's like 5:30, going on six. Between 5:30 and six. Earlier, I ended up using my uh, BK app. And we each got a Whopper because it was buy one get one, and that was our lunch earlier. And uh, Whoppers always do this to your shirt. No matter how careful I tried to be, it got on my shirt, and I wiped it, and it still left something there. So, dang the Whopper! But it was good. Um, tonight I'm just gonna have some watermelon because. We have a lot of it. Um, tomorrow, which will be in the same video, we're going somewhere special. And I can't wait. They haven't had it in a couple years. First time they've had it since COVID. So, that'll be what you see next on where we're going and what we're doing. Bye. It is... 65 degrees this morning. It's Saturday morning. We're getting ready to head out. Uh, that should be enough gas to get us down there and back. I like to lose that. Just each over half a tank, but we're just going there and back. And it's only like 15 minutes down the road, maybe 20 at most. I've never been to this uh, particular location. Um, so, because when we went to this before, it was not at this location. It was at a different location. So it's a whole new world for us today. All right, rolling out. Whoops. We're at the Renaissance Festival. Uh, but you'll see some stuff in a little while. Ooh, chain mail. Oh, I follow these guys on Facebook. Oh, they still have their uh, Mona Lisa. Her husband did that. It's awesome. We have the Viking Saga. That's our most complete source for Viking history. It was written 300 years after the end, or many of them were written about 300 years after the end of the Viking Age. So it's like if someone today wrote a historical fiction about the Revolutionary War, and we use that as a <laughs> the second rule for watching the Swords of Valor show is we love a crowd that interacts with us. I love a crowd that yells! Woo! Screams! Woo! I love a crowd that throws money at me! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you laugh, but it has worked more times than it hasn't. <laughs> I see the third rule for watching the Swords of Valor show. Why not? What? Right. So. This is a dangerous show. We are about to swing large chunks of metal at each other for your entertainment. And while elf entertainers will tell you to stay focused on us, I am a dangerous show. Sorry, we are a dangerous show. 
and this is a dangerous act. So please stay attention and keep your attention on us, because at any moment, one of these swords could break. Again. 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 <laughs> or we could lose a body part, and it could come flying out of the list. I need you to be paying attention so that when this happens, you can duck and make it the guy behind you's problem. Or use a small child as a shield. It works very well. No. no. Why? We got in trouble last time. Children, use your parents as shields. Okay. They've lived a long enough life. But this is the truth of the matter. This is dangerous. So I would like everybody to raise your hands in the air. Your daughter is mad at me. <laughs> I don't either. Yeah. I don't know, are you ready to take it? Oh. All right. Put her shield below. All right. Give me a sorry. Hey. Now we find someone of bigger size. Oh, I go for someone shorter than me to somebody who out who's taller than me. <laughs> and younger. <laughs> and younger. <laughs>
So got it. everybody came but um, I got to see the shows I wanted to see the jousting the Sentinels of the Rose which I'll see again in a couple weeks and Swords of Valor which I think I'll see again in a couple weeks but yeah Stacy's done we just got home and the one thing I bought to bring home from the Renaissance Fair is a turkey leg gotta get a turkey leg oh it smells so good smoked oh I'm gonna whittle on that it's kind of like breakfast because I haven't eaten anything yet today and maybe some tree tomatoes, some watermelon, but turkey leg time, turkey leg time. I just whittle on it with a knife and fork because I'm not a barbarian. It's smoked. It's really good. And then you have somebody down here mowing on it because she likes it. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Then I got my watermelon and my tomatoes. <laughs> 